Johnny Fontana, half amazing TV. Welcome to your final exam. Get a cafe? No? We're just some men that's on the mic. And when we rock up on the mic, we rock the mic. Alors, bueno. Let's get this on. So, we've gone through from my very first tutorial how to mix Deep House to what is house to how to mix this, how to program that, how to organize your folders, right? So what better way to end the summer, right? Do a final exam, right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do two parts, right? One, I'm gonna pick one track. It's gonna go and into a peak hour direction. That same track, I'm going to go into a, an after hours direction. However, I'm going to play the first song, okay, that, that track, and I'm going to now choose four songs. And from you, you're going to have to choose which song I'm going to mix, right? Then, once we choose the right song, I'm gonna show you how to pair the music via mix, right? I'm gonna show you the way that I've been hearing people mix, the way that people mix now, and I'm gonna show you the way that I do it in order to create that impact, right? So, let's get this started. Let's bring up the first track. doing here we're just I'm just showing you giving you a little taste of showing that we're gonna mix right and I'm gonna move it to the end all right so you're gonna be mixing this right here let that sink in let it sink in let it sink in all right you got that now we're gonna move into the songs I'm gonna give you four choices of songs that you're gonna mix remember we're gonna go into the peak hour now remember as we go into the peak hour or we're gonna step a notch okay you have to remember that it's not about just the tempo it's about the actual the, the groove itself and also pairing it in a way that it functions okay not just pairing the BPM okay but you also have to consider what kind of track it, what kind of track it is, okay? Because far too many DJs now are just mixing songs because they have the right BPM, or because you know they sound similar. But once the track comes in, it's like a totally different song, totally different atmosphere, and they dip and they dive and they go up and down, and there's just no continuity, all right? So we're gonna head and test out these tracks, and you let me know. Now, 
Remember, you have to be able to pick these things out quickly. Okay, if you've been listening to what, I, what I've been telling you, okay, in terms of um, listening to your music regularly, okay, keeping them in your folder, be able to just hear a song and be able to pick it up quickly. Okay, and here's the song again. So now, take a moment, all right? Don't fast forward the video, all right? Because this is a tutorial, so I want you, okay? I want you to rewind. Obviously, it's a video, so rewind, go back, okay? And figure out out of all those songs, there's one that not only matches the groove, the groove, because there are a couple that, that sort of match, right? You'd be like, oh, well, this couldn't even go. But I want to keep the continuity, okay? So it's not just the tempo, it's not just the groove, okay? But it's the actual, the vibe, okay? So that song, that dun 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 dun, okay? I want to be able to keep that vibe. So that's more like a techie, okay? Sort of progressive tech, okay? Not so much, but housey, okay? And then I want to go into a peak hour, okay? So I don't want to go too happy, I don't want to go too dark. I don't want to go too gloomy. I want to be able to keep that power. Okay, so which one do you think? You're probably wondering what the heck? Yeah. I feel like being a hipster now. Brooklyn hipster, Brooklyn! No, I'm serious. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is that we're gonna go ahead and mix the music how these, and no offense to hipsters, okay? Um, Cause I don't want anyone getting all like upset. But I'm going to play the, the music and mix it, okay? How I'm hearing it now. And it's, it's just really awful, okay? That you have a lot of DJs now who are just basically taking music and really not understanding how to pair, how to mix, how to groove, how to keep the dance floor and how to keep that vibe going. You see what I'm saying to you? Because people are dancing and that's the problem. A lot of people are not dancing so they don't understand. It's like it doesn't make sense to them. It's like, oh, well, I'm just going to put music to music to music to music. And even like a lot of the a lot of the DJs who send me mixes, you know, for me to critique and so forth, you guys are doing that. You know what I'm saying? Like you're just taking music and you know and some of you you know some of you get offended when i tell you that you know you're going back and forth but and then you get oh well this is my way of doing it and this is how i'm you know this is my way of djing and so forth and so forth. yeah but i get it but there's basics to this right i mean it's not just going back and forth in and out like you really have to understand like especially when it's dancing like if you take like a salsa nightclub people don't like their music mix number one but they don't like their music to be you know what i'm saying shifted in a way that it doesn't align with their dance steps so it's the same thing with if you're doing house dancing or if you're doing any kind of movement okay you want to have that stability and that continuity all right so let's get and do this and i'm going to mix it according to how i've been hearing because i do a lot of research i do probably more research than you would even imagine and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this and mix it according to how a lot of these DJs mix. All right, so let's go ahead and do this.
and you're gonna notice how this mix, okay, this is not the way that I mix, but I'm just showing you how I hear, I hear so many DJs, this is how they mix. Because a lot of it is not really understanding how to pair, and they don't have the intuition to see how the crowd is going to react. But also, it's the scared. They're just... That was the way that they DJ, all right? Let's go ahead and show you how me, Johnny Fontana, the official booth writer, how we do it. Let's go. All right, let's go. All right, hey, rocking a shirt, right? House music never evolved. You just changed genres, mofo. You know what I mean? It's my line right here. I'm still working on other t-shirts, other designs. This is mine, officially grown. Um, tell me what you think about it in the comment section. Um, I'm also looking a way how to, to market these things, right? Because I'm not the business type when it comes to marketing uh, and branding and all that stuff, right? I'm a DJ, you know what I'm saying? So I keep that to the specialist. But I'm really feeling this shirt. Um, but anyway, let's get ahead and do it my way. Now, for the purposes of this mix, okay, I'm going to actually um play a little bit more of the music all right so you really understand and get the groove and really understand and visualize okay where you are what's going on and how much of an impact and difference the way that i mix it makes all right let's get and do this oh cafe bustero some good stuff. Some cheap coffee, but excellent. Let's go.
Shaba use my loop. Totally different mix. So now what we're gonna get ahead and do, we're gonna get ahead and take that same track and now mix it going towards the after hours. Let's go. All right, so this is how everyone mixes into the after hours. Again, as you will hear, it's just dragging on and dragging on and dragging on, which is fine. Especially when you go into the after hours, you want to get them used to it. And everything, you want to get them used to it as well. But remember, when you are going into another vibe, you want to make sure that they get adjusted to it. But at the, at the end of the day, you also want to make an impact as well. So you can drag it, but at the same time make an impact. And you'll see how the difference between how I DJ, how I mix, dragging it, versus how everyone else does it. Yeah. Okay, it's cafe, no?
So that's how everyone else does it. Let's go ahead and show you how I do it, all right, and create that impact, okay, but at the same time, get them used to that vibe. Let's go.
We'll do it live! Hey, come! Fucking thing sucks! <laughs>